Hi guys, <clears throat> today I'm going to talk about how your time is actually very valuable. So I honestly learned how to enjoy myself by myself and do what I really want to do. I was the kind of person that uh, would try to make other happy people happy, but now I'm more focusing on myself and be more selfish. And honestly, it's I only <clears throat> would recommend it to certain people because some people think they're not selfish and they become even more selfish. That's not good. I genuinely believe that I was too nice and people always, I feel like, used me too much. So yeah, I learned how to be more selfish with my time. I started to talk more to people that actually value me and my time. I stop <clears throat> texting girls that don't really want to text <clears throat> and spend more time with my family and my friends who appreciate talking to me and I actually enjoy talking to them. And you start to realize your time actually valuable when you start getting paid per, per time that you work. So you low-key can see how much one, how much time you trade with your money. So that's like the beginning part where you spend your, you give your time to, for money. And as I'm an, assi I'm an assistant, so I save someone's time and I'm getting paid for that. <sighs> and I learned how that time is so valuable for us because when we're done with work, we have so much free time and it just depends on how you use it wisely. So you become you can become successful if you start to use it more wisely and do something that you actually want to pursue or a skill that you want to grow or build attractive body, attractive mind, anything that makes you an improvement in you, it's it's you putting, you putting uh, like it's called a raise of the skill or expectation. So <clears throat> it just it's like a skill button where you have a different levels of skills, and you use those points on things that you think is more valuable. Obviously, there's some people who just do the addictions, and it's okay to have certain addictions. I feel like and. It's just everyone co-ops with their own things through different stuff. But depending on what you use, if you're using addictions instead of your goals, skills, then you're gonna be miserable in the long term. And like I like to say is, if you're doing better, everyone else around you doing better because you're doing better. That's like a fact and people who don't feel that way they disappear from your life which makes it even better for you because you avoid the negative things or negative people so yeah I just learned how to prioritize my time and I started to respect me I respect myself more and I respect my time more and I'm being more organized on what things I want to do and what my time is spent on so yeah, just want to share that and thank you guys for watching the video. I'll see you guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Hello. Please don't kill me. Why oh, so cute? It's so fucking big though. Um, well, alright, bye, it was nice meeting you, you're cute, he has a friend, he has his friend, <laughs> so cute, he's like, I don't trust this guy, <laughs> the guy's like, hmm, fucking good, <laughs> Fucking delicious. <laughs>